players in Elise. Uh, almost every priest is like Mind Blast Priest. We'll keep Hallucination. I'm gonna keep Hallucination Elise. Screw them. Why is Elise my favorite card? Because it creates like cool, like uh, different you know sort of moments in each kind of each game that you play it in. Ooh, Glimmer Root. All right. Sweet. Even more things to steal. But she, she creates like cool dramatic moments that are, are like play out very differently from game to game, and I think that's like super cool. We'll start with a blink fox. <laughs> we must go deeper. Everything steals. Every single thing steals. Ooh, Tar Creeper, okay. I wonder if I wonder if he's like an inner fire deck, seeing that. If he does, like, Duskbreaker, we don't want to just get cleared and have this survive. Jake the Cake! Thanks for the cheer. Wanting to legend, but don't want to grind Q-Block or Aggro Pal, and I love Hearthstone, don't want to get bored of me. What do you suggest? Um, I mean, there's any number of things that I think you can you can reasonably play and get to legend. I mean, like, I think, like, you know, for instance, I played Rush Warrior to legend um, last season. I think it's a totally reasonable deck. It's not necessarily a great deck. But with the right matchups, I think that you can definitely get the legend with a lot of different things. One of the issues with playing, you know, a lot of decks outside of sort of the the, the core power decks is that they have they can often have like super super polarized matchups, and that can be really frustrating. Blessings to you too. I appreciate the uh, the kindness. He actually just still looks like he's playing playing like the the, the mind blast deck. I think that there's the odd even deck building stuff is like pretty interesting. I think that the the reward is something that can get pretty old pretty fast because, you know, you have it every game, you know. Coin. But do you have a circle of healing? Oh, you're gonna power shield that. In. Okay. I was like, circle of healing here would be unusual, but. All right. Um. Ooh, we got our deadly. Probably just gonna sap this. Can't backstab anything. If we sap this, cutlass this. Is mine. We could have deadly there. I don't know that I want to deadly um, deadly right now before you know because you can potentially just kill this this turn, and, and I'd rather save the deadly in case he does imme immediately kills it just for like two life this turn. Ooh, and Goro Pack. That's cute. I want to deadly it now. And then I can Goro Pack. Let's see what we get. Sudden Genesis. Evolving Spores. So many things. We can actually Kalamos next turn. Alright, I'm gonna Mind Blast you. Tar Creeper. Attack this, attack your face. Jade here, thanks for the 9-month resub. Uh, I'll be casting none. Yeah, there's a Gluttonous Juge. Boo. I have a Vine Cleaver now, though. It's pretty good. Can I also just... Kalamos Lightning Storm him? Yes. So, 3-3-3. Three, three, three. Trade this in. Alright. Okay, I love the Elise in this deck already. But yeah, I, I, uh, I'm I actually, for the rest of the year, probably not going to be doing... Well, not probably, that's what my contract is. <laughs> not going to be doing uh, the EU playoffs because they're just too horrible of a time zone for me, frankly. 
Um, I think I'm just gonna Vine Cleaver. We're actually, eh, Vine Cleaver actually kind of sucks. Maybe I just play this into this. Yeah. There's Tess. So what is Tess gonna actually cast now? She'll cast the Kalamos, which is interesting. She'll cast Kalamos, Mind Blast, um, Glimmer Root, Glimmer Root. Okay, at least he's shooting my stuff, not me. Mm-hmm. Doesn't cast in Goro Pack. Yeah, it'll cast a Duskbreaker now, too. Ooh, okay, well, that's great. But I haven't played an Elemental, so the test value is a lot lower. But test Shadow Step means I can do it again next turn. Oh, there's no Battle Cry anyway, right? I was thinking Shutter Walk. It's easy to get them confused. All right, we'll just play the test. Shadow Step Tess. Like, we're, de we're pretty much definitely going to get Psychic Screamed here, so I don't want to bother da backstabbing this. Oh, we're not getting Psychic Screamed. Okay. We're getting Duskbreakered again. Alright, that's fine. Well, I can test Spores, but we're probably just going to get, again, Psychic Screamed. Do I just Vine Cleaver, Blink Fox? I need, the, the problem is that I'm, I'm gonna die. So I kind of need to find something to keep me alive. Like, I'm just gonna get, like, Mind Blasted out because he already has Anduin. Kind of want to just Blink Fox, Vine Cleaver now. Holy smite. I'm try like the reason I wanted to play this was because I wanted to try and get um I wanted to try and get uh some sort of healing. Ugh. He hasn't played anything these visions for. Yeah. Okay, well there's something vision for. Eleven. Yeah, I'm dead to like a lot of things. Let's Pickpocket? Maybe you can find healing. Healing? No. Yeah, I'm probably dead. I'll backstab one of my guys so I can still draw something that can maybe heal me next turn. Test does not heal. There's, there's no healing spell that I've cast prior to Test. I need like a Divine Him. Sir Monticus, thanks for the two with the resubs. I'd love the magic content on YouTube. I'm glad you enjoy it. I can Psychic Scream, Deadly Poison, hit him for six. have this Evolving Spores, maybe that somehow kills him. I will scream all the test minions, that's true. I'm not gonna win by doing that. I need to actually just kill my opponent. And the Psychic Scream can be cast somewhere in the middle there, so it doesn't necessarily hit everything. Why is this super laggy all of a sudden? Everything is just suddenly super, super laggy. So Tess now is gonna cast a Mind Blast. And a Psychic Scream. I, I think I do just test now. Because I like I can't let this hit me. We don't want this in our deck. Or I guess it would be in his deck, so I should have... I actually don't want him to have cheap stuff, now that I think about it. But this gives me a Mind Blast and a Vine Cleaver. Ooh, what are you going to shoot? Shoot his face. Okay, it's not his face. Wait, What? Oh, it put the it put the test in his deck, so he he got it. He got the rest of the spells after the what? After it psychic screamed my test, he cast the glimmer root, and that actually just killed me. 
I'm betting. What? So it's divine him. Okay, I'm not. I'm not dead. I'm not dead. Despite the traitorous, the traitorous Tess. Get him! This lag makes this even more dramatic. All right. Well, now, now we know to be careful of Tess plus Psychic Scream. We know to be real careful. Because <laughs> that was nearly a disaster.